pop queen Christina Aguilera made all women feel beautiful with her Grammy-winning hit. One of the most successful recording artists of the last decade, Christina has sold more than 30 million records, earned five Grammys, and been compared to Barbra Streisand, Whitney Houston, and Celine Dion. With one of the finest voices of her generation, Christina has been belting it out since she was six years old. As she grew up, so did her music and her image. Married now for four years to music executive Jordan Bratman, Christina has been busy raising the couple's two-year-old son, Max, and decorating their over-the-top Beverly Hills mansion, once owned by the Osbournes. <laughs> Now Christina's back with her first new album in four years, Bionic, and a new single that is very provocative. And of course, she is going to take the stage in just a few minutes. I hear it's an eye popper, but first let's catch up. Welcome Christina Aguilera. I was just telling her before we started, your lips are perfection. Oh my yeah. gosh, my makeup artist Christopher Buckle's gonna die. Oh no, they are perfection. <laughs> but has this break been good for you? Uh, has this break been good for me? Yes, um, becoming a mother since the break. I, I like to take time in between records and just live life for a moment, gather mm -hmm. my thoughts, my inspirations for what the next record's gonna be. And when you're just living life, what are you doing? Uh, just relaxing, taking it all in, um, absorbing my surroundings and uh, getting comfortable. We bought a new home, I had a child, enjoyed my pregnancy. Um, I just take those moments to live life so that I can be inspired even more so as an artist. And I understand that earlier this year you took a trip to uh, Guatemala. I what did. was that all about? Uh, I'm becoming a UN ambassador for world hunger with the That's WFP great. World Food that Program. Taking a trip, thank you. I'll be taking a trip to um, Haiti uh, this week to uh, check out the situation there and, and assess. We just helped uh, deliver food. I, I visit orphanages and the schools there and uh, try to do my part in helping this. And doesn't that just change your whole perspective on your own life when you wake up in the morning and you've oh my been able to experience other worlds like Tremendously. that? Tremendously. A child dies every six seconds of uh, hunger, which was a huge uh, statistic for me and one that I, and I, I, you know, after having my own child, I was like, I, I have to be a part of this and do my part some way in giving, giving uh, and helping the situation. I, I had read this. Tell me if this is true that you said this, because you can't believe what you read about anybody. Yeah. But um, uh, did you say that having a child actually made you feel sexier? Absolutely, yeah. Because I think, I think it's women. You know, our bodies. Oh, thank you, <laughs> Maxie boy. Um, our bodies go through such amazing things, and we are super human. I mean, we give life, we give birth, we uh, are our child's source of everything. You know, um, our bodies are not our own for a time period, and 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 we givingly and willingly do so for our child. But then when we get them back, you feel that much stronger and that much better, and you know, more confident. And sure, I have a difference in my body than I had before, but I'm more confident in that, knowing where I've been and, and coming full circle with that and just feeling more comfortable in my own, own body. And as a woman, you know, you that know a, what you want more, you know how to yes. get it. And uh, what you That a child do. came from your womb. Yes. <laughs> I mean, I think it's pretty superhuman and that's where the whole inspiration for Bionic came from. Well, we're going to get a little piece of Bionic when we come back. Yes. She's going to belt it out. Her new album, Bionic, will be in the stores June 8th. And tickets for her world tour go on sale May 21st at LiveNation.com. So as we go to break, I want to say thank you to our friends at New Balance. Thanks. Take a look.